are naive. They're very easily influenced. And it's not even that is right or wrong. They're just not that bright to even know what they're doing. They're just very easily influenced. And you know what? That's why we here today to influence in them to the positive. That's a whole fact. Yeah, we ain't but mad you, at you. If but you, you have know. to make sure that you you surround yourself with positive people as well too. And that's why we here. I see. Indeed. We listen. We no, here but, for that. But you know, but we're talking about that. But we want to tell people that's out there as well too that they need to view people that's in their life. There you go. To make sure that everyone that's in their life is a cheerleader. Mm -hmm. Everyone that's in their life is on their bandwagon. They're not in their boat drilling fucking holes. You know what I mean? I want to tell everybody, yeah, to be positive, but I want everybody to be aware, too. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? A lot of kids are getting kidnapped. A lot of girls are getting kidnapped. My friend been looking for her daughter for seven days, and she can't find She still can't find her. The police been looking for her everything. She still can't find her. Keep your I can't eyes imagine how good that feel, but I need her to be aware. Yeah. I, need, I need everyone to be aware because it's so dangerous. Even looking at the internet, as you said, yeah. I see so many things. So I want people not to be so easily fluent to drink this, to take this, because everyone else is doing. You know how many people are dying from overdose from fentanyl? Yeah. So I want to talk about things like that, too, to prevent well, our young listen, people. I'm, listen, I'm here for you. Let's To prevent our young people from not doing that, from influencing. There you go. Let's because do they it. don't know. I'm with it's okay that. to be different. It's okay not to, because everybody, No. You don't have to be like everybody else and try it. And some people don't feel like that because of society. You know what I mean? So when I push my agenda that I want us to be A, B, and C, I don't want people to misconstrue that. Because certain people think that if you don't look like this or dress like this, you're not cool. Mm -hmm. Especially with females. They have a lot of things with body shame in their self because they don't look like certain ways. So I want them to know also that you are beautiful in whatever size and shape that God made you to be. Yeah. Whether just, you're they, big, small, medium, and large, you are. You they, they gotta just, love they just changed all the big parenting facts, rules on the social apps just for that. They said the number one, you know, depression that goes around is is the girls. They're the most impressionable because of social media, because right. of what the standards have to be to stand the third. And they're the ones. So now, you know, your parents are able to govern the way you watch the shit because you're so influence yeah you gotta be careful it's the whole fact even on tiktok and um apps like you it's mm -hmm. it's crazy so i i want to i want to touch on that too yeah i want you to be powerful a b and c but i want you to also don't be a yes man just because you see an opportunity in your face and it's just glitter and gold everything that glitter is not gold yeah so I want you guys still to be aware because even though technology and the times are really good and fast now too, it's really, really smart too. So you got to make sure that you're on point. And that's a fact. For sure, for sure. That's a whole fact. If you could tell anything to the kids that's looking up to you, what would it be? Well, the most important thing I try to tell any kid is this, try to make better choices that you can recognize because some choices like you just said they might not be able to recognize so as long as it's a you can see a choice and you can make the best choice you can say yay or no or good like somebody try to pass you some weed or like you saying something and you don't feel like you want to do it don't let nobody say pressure. yeah yeah so, peer you know, pressure that's what i you know because i know peer pressure is a major thing with most kids and they follow mm -hmm. what they see in front of them or what so, they think is cool so, you know, if I got to say anything a kid, I would say that, like, just try to make the best choices you can make as, as far as you can recognize. Because I can say what I'm saying, but like I said, it don't got to be, I could be wanting to inspire them to do whatever. I don't want, I don't want to inspire you to do what I'm doing. Because do what you love. That's right. I and want, I love that. Yeah, I, I love want to inspire exactly you, but I want to inspire you to say, I'm only doing this. Because you love it. Yeah, if I didn't, somebody had told me, they know I like to drive. So they was like, why you don't get a CDL? I was like, because I like to go home to sleep at night. And I don't want to be on the highway driving to California and Florida and sleeping in trucks. And, oh, wow. You know, I know it's other ways, but that's the one where they probably make the most money. So that's why people say the CDL, because if they could take a load from New York to California or Florida, that's a good money. But you got to sleep on the road. I don't want to do that. I want to go home every night and get a good sleep. You know what I mean? So like I said, everything is, is, is different. But any kid, like I said, I love all kids. I want to inspire y'all to be great. You know what I mean? And, and, and keep 
just, just stay intelligent, you know, go to school, get your education, and then figure out whatever you want to do. You know what I mean? At least do that much. At least go through 12th grade or whatever and learn. But also, with, with Instagram or YouTube, like you said, some stuff they might not teach in school. Back to the financial literacy you know what I mean? So That's a whole if fact you can't you find a mentor, if you can't find a mentor right in front of you, if you could go on your phone or Instagram, they on there. Okay. Um, like I said, there's a lot of them that, you know, I don't really can't name all the names, but, you know, there's a lot of them up there. I listen to Les Brown. 